Hello and welcome to this Dr. L Explains video. Today we're going to be sticking with atomic structure, but we're going to be looking at electron arrangements, and fuller details of this can be found on pages 28 and 29 of your textbook. Our classical atomic picture, one we've seen in the last two videos, our nucleus at the centre, our protons and neutrons in the nucleus, our electrons going around the outside, very much like the uh, nuclear symbol you see of the uh, start of every Simpsons episode, is all well and good. However, for our GCSE atomic picture, we need a little more detail, and we're going to look at that now. So, here, at GCSE, electrons are arranged in shells around the nucleus. We can see these shells here in the diagram of our example sodium that we're going to move out, about to move on to. Our shells, we should note, are also called energy levels. Energy levels. The lowest energy levels are those closest to the nucleus. The highest energy levels are the ones furthest from the nucleus. Next point to note. Electrons fill up from the lowest available energy level outwards. So, for sodium, our example, sodium is element number 11, atomic number 11, therefore 11 protons, and as atoms are neutral, 11 electrons. Into our first shell go two electrons. The first shell can take two electrons only. Our second shell can take eight electrons. Six, seven, and eight. Two plus our eight is ten. We know there are 11. Our one final electron goes in the highest shell there on the outside. One thing to note at this stage is the number of outer electrons, so the very, very outer ring, one for sodium, is the same as the group number in the periodic table for that element. So if you look up sodium in your periodic table, you'll find it there in group one. Similarly, or the same for all elements, I should say, let's look at example number two, which will be neon. Now, neon is element number ten, one before sodium. So again, our nucleus in the centre, our first shell takes two electrons, and our second shell for neon, one, two, three, four. Two plus eight is ten. That's the entire amount of electrons that neon has. 10 electrons. 10 electrons for neon. A full outer shell, the most electrons the second shell can take, is 8. Neon is a noble gas. It, it sits in group 0 of the periodic table on the far right hand side. It has a full outer shell, as we just said. And this full outer shell makes it very, very stable and very unreactive. Thanks for watching. See you next time.